So Coach Santos, it's your first year here. Just kind of talk about what it's like your first season so far. Well, I mean, I've, I've been here around since the day I graduated in the coaching staff. So, you know, it's just, it has been a transition for me. Obviously, the responsibilities is a lot higher than than just being one more guy in the coaching staff. But I just want to say thank you to Coach, Gro coach Groves, Coach Jonah that were here previously, gave me a lot of space to, to grow myself as a coach. And obviously, you know, Coach Jenkins, Coach Sampley, uh, Dr. Tavener, Dr. Grafton, and all those for the opportunity to be here. I, you know, I love Lion and I'm happy with it. But, you know, we, we've lost quite a few seniors that graduated from last year. Some of them had, you know, a great impact in, your, in our program. I think we're also able to keep a good core group together that was important last year and is going to be even more important this year. And, you know, with those, adding a good, good class of, you know, newcomers that are coming in and, and, and are helping big time as well for us to, to keep ourselves where we are. You've seen, a couple, you've seen them play a couple of scrimmages now. What, how do you feel about the team? What do you think about it? I think, you know, we, we started preseason just about two weeks from now and, uh, you know, just throwing ideas out there and you know getting them building up and getting confident in into those ideas i think was the main thing for us during those two first weeks and we, we can clearly see improvement from the first scrimmage to the second scrimmage obviously you know tomorrow is our opener and it's it's a different ball game but i think we're ready we it's it's looking good i'm happy i'm happy with how discipline and, and how good the team looks so just exciting for the season Ranked 22nd in the NAI. Um, what are your thoughts on that? I think it's fair. I mean, you know, I know that out there there's probably quite a few questions with us going D3, things like that. But, you know, it's it's fair for what we've done last year. And our schedule, actually, we play a lot of very competitive teams that want to be where we are and some other ranked teams as well, especially in the non-conference side. So... It's it's a responsibility, and we just got to make sure we're we're on top of ourselves to to stay where we are at least. Right now, you're still in the American Midwest Conference, and that's pretty tough. They've got you picked second in the preseason polls. But talk a little bit about the conference and the schedule that you got coming up with them. It's it's fair as well. You know, I think we we've won the double last year, but Columbia made it all the way to the final four. It's a very strong team, and that's why they got picked first. And it, it, you know, it's understandable. We're really close to them. I think, you know, there's Missouri Baptist, there's Williams Baptist, Harry Stowe did very good last year, so Central Central Baptist, and then can't forget the other teams as well. So it's 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 a very competitive conference, and I think the way that the team looks this year, we are, we are pretty ready to, to fight for the titles again. Talk about some of your players, you know, what to expect out of them, maybe some of the, the future ones that we could see big things out of this year. I think the you know as I mentioned before we have a core group coming back, but there's a lot of guys with a lot of potential that they didn't have as many minutes as they'd like to have last year, and they're just you know hungry to come back and have a higher impact than what they've had in our program, and I think that's one of the things that I'm you know looking at the most and being like okay that's how, that's what's gonna make us strong and. You know, we have two All-Americans returning. You know, that's that's we had four last year, so that's something that's going to help us out as well. Uh, we have Leonardo Galdino and, and Bosco Perry, and we have Mauro Garitano, center back that was all conference as well. So I mean, you know, and then you have Mati, you have Ronaldo, you know, Tavares, players that had an impact, Andre, four two players that had an impact for us last year, and again, just looking at you know, filling bigger roles from the ones that they had previously, and I think they're ready for it. And we also have about, you know, a dozen of newcomers that each one has its own individual qualities that will, will bring in and, and, and blend together, and I think that's just exciting and is taking us in the right direction. Ultimate goal for this team this year? Well, when you have two trof trophies sitting in your office, I just you can just think about them again, right? It's, it's just normal, and I've been telling that the guys, like, you know, when you win, you know how good it feels, and you want to do it again. So I think the goal's got to be it. And I think we just, again, like, I'm very happy with how disciplined this group is, and that's, like, if they can keep the discipline, the mentality that they've been showing through preseason, it's, it's going to be a great season, and 
you know, me and, and Coach Alex are very, very exciting to get that going.